Yes, hello. Hello. How are you? Okay, okay. Can you hear me? Yes, yes. I am very good, thank you. What about you? You are good? Yes. Okay. Because today is Saturday. It's Saturday. So <laughs> you are free. No you are free today. Means you have no office work. Um yes. It's mean today it's my weekend. Not have the official uh, days for work, but I have a lot of work. Uh, we didn't uh, finish yet. No problem. After class, you may do your work, your job. Uh, you may enjoy your day. No, I, I don't have a plan uh, to work on Saturday, but maybe I have to work. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's life. Okay. Hmm. It's life. Life goes like that. Yeah, as you told me, this is good, right? Yeah. And try okay. to be happy in each and every moment of your life. Yeah. Try to be happy. Try to smile. Try to laugh a lot. Even if you are alone, you should laugh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, we will start first with uh, the story. Huh? Okay. Uh, um, I will share this. We cannot remember all of that. Instead of England person, you should say English. Oh, English. Yeah. English person. Yeah, the people are oh. people are English and they speak uh, English language. Oh, okay. Like English. like you are Thai person and you speak Thai language. Coming festival, you can say. Oh, coming festival. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. They start saving money every month after each Christmas. To for, for. Uh, for, for next Christmas. Yes. Okay. So one month before Christmas is coming, uh -huh, they have, uh, they go to market. Uh -huh. And a job, they know how much they can buy, and they can use the furniture and other things to decorate their house. Mm -hmm. uh, Every things are so easy and comfortable uh -huh, to do because they have a plan before. Okay, and uh, they enjoy. And uh, they are very happy at that festival. Very good. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. This is a cover over all your stories. Yeah, yes, right? yes, yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. And for the next is for... Uh, now, you, now it means if you are able to write what I speak, it means you are improving your listening power. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Means you have understood everything and you have written it in your own words. Okay. That's good. Because, mm. uh, I think uh, you uh, talk um, a lot more than this, but uh, I cannot remember all of that. Mm. Okay. Uh, 
comprehend no problem but you have understood the sense ah, ah okay okay, okay. Uh-huh. and for the next is uh, questions Yes, today. It's Saturday. Oh. Yes, after your class, I am going to temple. Yes. What time do you spend? Uh-huh, yeah, I leave my home around uh, 12.30 in the oh. noon. In the noon. Oh. Yeah, okay. and I come back after three or four hours. Oh, in temple, it's uh, near. Your no, no, house. no. It's uh, 25 kilometers from here. You drive? Yes. Alone? Not alone with my, you know, local students. Now they have become, you know, uh, father. Oh, <laughs> local students? Yeah, old students. Oh, my old okay. students. I have very good relation with them. So, uh, they come with me in my car, we go there, we enjoy, even we have food there in the temple Mm -hmm. itself. Uh, So, Mm. we enjoy it. Okay, your wife is going together or not? No, she goes to school. Today is Saturday. Yeah, but but school is there, yes. No, No holiday for, no, no weekend for. Only Sunday is the weekend for her. Oh, yeah. oh okay, okay. Uh-huh. It's me today, you are single, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Of the day. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm just kidding. Okay. <laughs> um, and the second is how about Indian habits? Okay, I have asked for, uh, for this question like a uh, type, uh, type person. Uh-huh. It's uh, like a so chill uh, habit. Uh, mm-hmm. We are not in uh, hurry to do something. Uh, That's good. Is, um, slow. Very good. That's but, very good. Uh, but I would like to uh, know about uh, Indian habits. Actually, in India, you know, the people who live in, you know. Okay. One minute, one minute. Yeah. In, in in India actually the people who, in India the people who live in you know uh, big cities like Mumbai, Calcutta, Bangalore, Chennai, you know the people who live in big cities they they are always in hurry. Yeah, but the people who live in you know small cities, they <coughs> they are not in hurry. I think your husband is talking to someone. Yeah, yeah, someone. On phone. No, no, uh, some someone uh, go to uh, spraying about uh, dessert. Okay, about oh, 50, oh, I think about 10, 10 or 15 minutes. Okay, uh, so uh, it is like that. Okay, okay, you are okay, right? Hmm? You, you are okay, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Okay, for now we are start around 10 minutes, we can go back again, right? What, what? Wait, wait, you can't continue. Yeah. Or you would like me to uh, go back and no, no, no. to go learn again? No, 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 no. Let's, oh, okay. let's continue. Don't worry. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. And for the next is, um, okay, as uh, in number two, right? In number three is, are you usually early or late? I am always early. <laughs> I am, I, 
I don't know. <laughs> No, no, it's okay. Okay, I've got it before now. Uh, I, I try uh, to change a bit because I I less uh, the time for every people, but sometimes that I have a, a lot of things to do. Uh, I cannot manage all of this. Uh, I think I try try to uh, I think I hurry. Yeah. <laughs> It's okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. And for number four, it's how uh, many uh, big festival in India? Uh, as I uh, we we talk about uh, Diwali. Uh, Diwali. Diwali. Yeah. yeah. And how many big festival that you have? Ah uh, yes, there are many big festivals in uh, India. Because actually, you know, India is a very big country and India has got, you know, 29 states mm -hmm. and each and every state has its own culture. Mm -hmm. They have their own language, they have their own culture, they have their own festival. So it's a yeah. so it's a big country. That's why there are lot of uh, you know festivals celebrated in India. Oh, okay. 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 Uh, um, uh, I think it's me. Uh, in uh, officially of a big festival. Ah, officially three or four maybe in a year. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, about the money, about, uh, oh, how about the tree? Yeah, yeah, Holi. Holi? Yeah. Holi? Uh -huh. It is a festival of colors. You know, you might have seen some videos on internet that people throw, uh, you know, uh, dry colors on each other, they dance together. Have you seen such kind of video on internet? Oh, okay. okay. Yes, this is the festival of colors. Oh, uh, I have seen it, uh, that before about the color of the color that we throw to yeah. someone, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. What is the meaning that we, we do about this? There is a story actually behind this that why we celebrate. This is the festival of, you know, togetherness, means uh, when, suppose uh, you are my friend and sometimes, you know, when we are together, we go to office together or whatever, sometime I say something to you, you don't like it and all these things happens in our life, you know. So what we do on that day? We come together, we put, uh, we put color on their cheek and we hug each other and, uh, you know, we celebrate, we have food together, so we forget everything happened in the past. Mm. Oh, yeah. it's in, uh, everything that in the past, we will uh, forget and start again yes holy festival right? yes 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 oh okay okay um okay which month of this festival march march oh, yeah. okay yeah it's good okay uh -huh. and for the next is um okay what is your uh, favorite part of travel Oh, what is your favorite part of tra my favorite part of traveling is mm -hmm. uh, going through you know forest and mm -hmm. I stop my car there if I see anything good in, uh, in nature means like forest mm -hmm. like you know waterfall or sometimes you know uh, river mm -hmm. so I stop my car there and I go there, I enjoy, I just take, you know, pictures. So I mm. just means enjoy my traveling. Mm. Right. Okay, it's me for number seven. Uh -huh. uh, do you like the mountain and forest more than 
seeing, right? Yeah. Mountain, okay. forest, rivers, waterfall. Mm. Okay, okay. <laughs> and for the next is, would you uh, rather cram a bottle or a deep sea drive? Uh, I would like to climb, you know, mountain. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I like it. I like it. Oh. Yeah. In your city? Not in my city, but uh, out of my city. Oh, okay. Uh, Ramana is which country that you would like to go there? Mm -hmm. uh, I would like to go to Thailand. Oh, next okay. time, next time, if uh, the conditions are normal, I would like to go to Thailand. Mm, okay. And I would like to see you there. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. And, okay. And I think number ten is. Uh, I got the answer first. I asked where is the most relaxing place you have ever been. It's me forest, right? Yeah. You drive to the forest. And you know, one more thing I want to tell you, the temple where I go uh, every Saturday, this is also, you know, between the forest. That temple is on the mountain. Oh, yeah. awesome. In Thailand, the temple in, uh, in the mountain, right? Yeah. So I enjoy, so today or every Saturday I go to that temple, so I enjoy you know, the, the temple is surrounded by, you know, mountains and forests mm -hmm. and all. So, I enjoy it. In, in your uh, country, uh -huh, in the temple, it's half a monk or not? No, yes, not monk, but uh, priests are there, priests. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Priest, okay. yeah, they bless, they bless you like this. Oh, yes. okay, okay. Uh -huh. So the next is okay in Thailand. Uh, we have around four uh so the so uh -huh, in in our uh, country. Uh, in your city, you have a so or not? I couldn't understand. What does it mean? Oh, okay. So, so, so. How do you spell? Oh, uh, okay. Zoo. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, we have got, yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. You have uh, the uh, special um, animal from other country? Uh, Actually, you know, in my city, it's a small zoo. Oh, small. Yeah, but it is good because it is surrounded by, you know, the forest and uh, the people inside for a uh, zoo, they enjoy eating ice cream, snacks and all, and they watch animals. So, oh. it's a good place. Alpha? Hmm? Alpha? Ele yes, yes, elephant, zebra, lion tiger and many kind of different parrots birds monkeys different different types of monkeys oh. yeah yeah same same yeah. in thailand okay in thailand we have a night zoo we can uh, go to the only uh, in the night oh mm. and um, when we are there, we are not walking, uh, but uh, in that place, a uh, guide have a uh, train, uh -huh, and uh, we will sit there and uh, go with guide and with the other person. Uh -huh. Yeah, such or kind of it? thing we have got, you know, national park. Mm -hmm. We have got national parks in india and they are means they are a big forest big forest and there are a lot of animals there if you want to see them you have to go with the special you know that 
car mm. Which, mm. Yes, yes. which which has no sound you know oh. yeah so mm. otherwise you know the animals uh, may get disturbed so they may you know run away or yes, yeah yes. so <laughs> it is very good even we have got a very good you know bird sanctuary we have got bird sanctuary so there are lot of means thousands of thousands of birds you know from different countries come over there yeah in in india in india actually that is the place this is uh, just you know 100 kilometers from my city yeah that bird oh. sanctuary it is a very nice place actually when you go there they give you you know uh, you can have either bicycle oh. yeah you can uh, take their bicycle you should have you know binocular or uh, you should have a camera with you if you want to see them you can see with your binocular or uh, me it is very good actually you know they have made different places for the birds and the birds from you know Sib siberian birds a lot of birds you know come over here in india to that place only every year and, and, and they go back after 2 3 months when when summer begins they go back Oh, but okay. but during winter they start coming in uh, december mm, they start okay. coming to that place in december and they go back in uh, february last okay oh uh, i think in uh, thailand uh, when we go to a national uh, or a night zoo uh -huh, we cannot take a photo with flash uh -huh. mm. because the animal will run away ah uh, yes yes mm. or, and or they they may be or they may be scared mm. 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 Yes. Okay. okay and for the next is uh, okay what the number 12 uh, what is something that you will never do it again ah uh, yes uh, I don't know, but uh, I don't think. I uh, yes, one once actually few years back. Mm -hmm. um, or you can say, um, okay, I, I example. yeah, just you the twenty or twenty okay. years back actually. You know, I used to take you know wine. Twenty mm -hmm. years back. Mm. and i gave up that habit and now i will <laughs> never drink again oh how you feel in first time right nothing now i am i don't feel uh, means like to Can drink i remember right about that because very really long time 20 years ago 20 or maybe 24 years back actually i gave up 24 yes 24 yeah oh. My daughter was born, and I gave up. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. Um. Um. For number thirteen is okay. What is your biggest kitchen fail? I have a lot. <laughs> Nothing, I think. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. I have a lot. I mm. try to. Uh, buy a uh, vegetable in meat in uh, a lot of uh, ingredients and uh, I try to mix and it finally I cannot eat that <laughs> okay uh -huh. and okay and for the next is number 14 uh -huh. which movie make you cry uh -huh. I, I have seen lot of movies Mm -hmm. uh, and they really made me cry because they were emotional movies. Oh, oh. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, I like to see the emotional movie in sometimes like um, uh, 
a lot of movie mm. and I spend the time on that uh, together with my husband and I think it's uh, a good time uh, to uh, to have a good feel uh, and maybe we cry sometimes because the movie is emotionally it's very, uh, uh-huh. emotionally mm-hmm. yes okay and for number 50 uh-huh. do you prefer the warm weather or cold weather both Really? Yeah, I, en- I enjoy, you know, warm weather also and I enjoy cold weather also. Oh, yeah. I think I like the cold weather. And warm weather? No, because sometimes, because Thailand is uh, hot weather uh-huh, around 70 or 80 percent of, of, of years. Mm. I, I like the cold weather, okay? Mm. And number 60, uh-huh. What is your favorite breakfast? Fruits. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. And number 17 is what is your your story? Uh-huh. What style of your favorite travel trips that you like? By car, most of the Dri- time. Yeah. Drive a car. Yeah, mm-hmm. I drive my car myself. Mm-hmm. Okay. I I enjoy okay. driving. Oh, and singing the singing side, right? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, okay. And number 18 is uh, how do you plan for next trip? Maybe next month. When? Ah, uh, yes. Uh, in India only. Oh, yes. together with your wife? Uh, no, because she is not free. Because you both are single. <laughs> not, it's not like that. <laughs> okay, yeah. okay. Uh, number 19 is how do you feel about uh, interacting uh, with the local or the other people while in travel? I enjoy interacting with them because mm-hmm. you know we learn a lot of new things from them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, Sammy. Okay, and the last is which things uh-huh. Oh, you really like to do when you are traveling? Ah, yes, taking, you know, pictures, eating, eating, you know. Uh, I, <laughs> I don't take care of my fitness that day in traveling. I yeah. eat, I eat everything. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Same because I think uh, when I'm traveling, I would like to try uh, new food yes. and eat uh, all the new things. Uh, I try to eat uh, yes. uh, local food. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, so, because it's, uh, I think it's uh, interesting and it is uh, cheap. Cheaper, cheaper, more yeah. than in the mall and in the mm-hmm. restaurant. Yeah, but when I come back after traveling, after four or five days or six days, I see I have gained some weight, like two, yes. like two kg, maybe two kg, three kg. Mm-hmm. Then I start working again. <laughs> it's worth. Mm, it's worth to do that because. I am uh, traveling and uh, let's take a new thing and take a rest uh, mm-hmm. and learn a uh, life from, uh, from that. Yes, yes. Okay, this okay. is all of that. Uh, okay, so today now we are going to learn a new topic mm-hmm. in grammar and I think it is very important for you to learn. Hmm. You know, uh, we are going to learn adjectives. Oh, adjective, adjective. Yeah. Adjective, it means uh, beautiful. Yes, yes. Adjective means the words, the words which modify uh, the verb or the noun. 
like suppose i say you are a beautiful lady oh you are you right no 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 it's true like i say you are a lady it is simple sentence but if i say you are a beautiful lady so beautiful is an adjective because it is adding something to the lady or i can say you are a kind lady you are an honest lady you are a tall lady Mm. all these all these words are adjective oh okay okay i understand even the colors are adjectives like we say white black green yellow these are also adjective mm. okay so adjective mm. means the quality of a noun or verb okay okay mm. understand Okay. Okay. It's okay. It's maybe you add something. Uh huh. Uh, something. Uh, before what, right? Yeah. Before. Oh, no, uh, before bef- noun. Yes. Before noun or before verb. So here I am going to tell you some of the examples to understand it in a better way. Okay. Okay. So like suppose I say let's start with you. You are. a lady suppose this is a sentence okay. okay but now i am going to use adjective here okay you are a good lady yeah. you are a beautiful lady good is an adjective mm-hmm. beautiful is an adjective hmm. but we have three you know degrees adjectives like positive comparative superlative this is positive if i say good hmm. comparative comparative what is the comparative of good do you know mm-hmm. yes i know i know let, i know yeah let me know uh, the comparative of good okay as i understand uh, comparative of good it's been um better ah uh, yeah yeah it's a uh, Um, like good and better and uh, sometimes we use a modern, right? Something good, modern, something right? Like good is positive. Better is positive. Better is comparative. Best is superlative. Mm-hmm. I know, I know, I know, I know. But how we use them? I'm telling you, you are a good lady. Or suppose I say you are a This is positive simple sentence you are a beautiful lady but if I compare you with your sister or with someone else mm. Mm-hmm. then i can say you are then i make comparative of it like you are more beautiful than your sister oh okay thank you you did you say <laughs> my sister more beautiful than you thank you <laughs> so you are i you are more beautiful than your sister so this is comparative mm-hmm. okay understand and thank now you. i use it in superlative mm. like you are the we have to use the mm. with 
superlative you are so when we make the positives comparative and superlative of beautiful it is always like beautiful more beautiful most beautiful when you are the most beautiful lady in this colony suppose i say right you are the most beautiful lady in this colony you know understand colony you don't know mm. i'm not sure colony means like a place it has a name and lot of houses are there oh oh yeah. okay. okay i know i know so you this is superlative now again i say okay let me know which is the biggest city in thailand mm bangkok okay bang bangkok is this right no bangkok okay okay mm. bang bangkok mm. okay 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 so bangkok let me tell you few sentences about bangkok okay mm. like i say bangkok is a big city okay bangkok is bigger than bigger than then um, let me okay. know any other city in uh, okay. thailand okay ha ah, okay okay uh, like, okay it's in the south of uh, thailand yes i know the name uh, it is famous <laughs> it is famous uh, yes. yeah it is famous and lot of people from india they go to phuket because they have their companies meeting there or something like that yes yes sure so, so bangkok now see that second sentence this is comparative now i am using bigger big positive bigger than okay like you are taller than your sister taller you understand taller and yeah understand yeah short shorter yeah shorter shortest mm, shortest tall mm. taller tallest tallest okay so okay. bangkok is bigger than phuket now i say bangkok is the biggest city in thailand Yes, very good. In Thailand, mm -hmm. Bangkok is the is biggest the... city in Thailand. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, oh, correct. Yeah. Now, I tell you some more sentences. Okay. About adjectives, and they are very useful for you. to make sentences or to speak english okay you must know them okay okay that's why i'm telling you <clears throat> now uh, the next sentence i tell you like we say bang cock is as big as Bangkok is as big as suppose i say delhi okay see this okay you understand the meaning understand uh i think we use when we compare something that uh the same right yes Bangkok is as big as Delhi. Wow. 
Mm -hmm. Right? You are as good as your sister. Mm -hmm. You you are as beautiful as your sister. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. You are as tall as your sister. Mm. Okay. Right? She is as fat as her mother. Mm -hmm. okay. 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 Do you have fat people in Thailand? Mm, yeah, we have. We no, have. Not many. Mm, not many because um, I think when the uh, woman uh -huh, feeling the fat, uh -huh, it's me not popular. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so so almost all the women in Thailand try to uh, very, very maintain. Thin. Maintain. Yeah. Uh, we say women in Thailand they yeah. try they try to maintain their figure. Uh, maintain, yeah, 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 you are correct. Men maintain. Uh, I think like uh, the easy word is maintain their body. Uh, instead of body, you should say maintain their figure. Oh, figure. Okay, so I think in Thailand, I uh have -huh, fitness. Fitness. I uh -huh, gym. I uh -huh, business is very, very uh, grow up. Uh -huh. Popular, yes. 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 Okay. So figure, figure means figure. They, yeah. they, are, they are in the shape like that or whatever. <laughs> Yeah, so they, that is called figure instead of figure. body. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. they like to maintain their figure. Okay. Yes. Okay. So Bangkok is as big as Delhi. Okay. And now one more sentence. I mm -hmm. use no city is as big as. Bangkok in Thailand. See this sentence. No city is. Oh. Sorry, sorry, let me write is. City, yeah. city. So you can make that sentence in that way also. No city is as big as Bangkok. In Thailand, Bangkok is as big as Delhi. Bangkok is the biggest city. Or you can say one more sentence. Bangkok is one of the Biggest cities in Thailand. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, why we use is uh, in helping work and uh, city we has uh, it is but like um, a lot of. Yeah, Bangkok is one of the biggest cities. Ah, Means okay. there are a lot of biggest big cities, but Bangkok is one of the biggest cities. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Understand. You are one of the you are one of the most beautiful ladies mm -hmm. in Thailand. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm. Mm. No, no, don't think like that. We must be thankful to the God always. That God has made you, you know, uh, what I should say, a, a good human being. And He has given you that face, you know, eyes, nose, ears. 
beautiful hair everything you are having food you are having house you have job everything you have got so we are beautiful mm -hmm. creatures of the god okay. right yes yeah. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. And one more, I tell you. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, could, could we use this in the question sentence? Yes, you can use. You can use in past tense. You can use in future tense. You can make questions also. Okay, I have one sentence. Okay, it's me. If I use in the question sentence, mm -hmm. I can use on this or not. Okay, is uh -huh, uh, is Bangkok is is Bangkok uh oh, no no uh -huh. uh is the Bangkok uh no I can't do. <laughs> to help to work in no, 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 one helping verb only in the beginning. Is Bangkok the biggest city in Thailand? Yes, very good. Oh, okay. okay. You cannot use two helping verb. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. But if you are making a question, take the helping verb in the beginning or be, start your sentence with helping verb. Okay, okay, it's Bangkok. Okay. Right? Yes. Oh, okay. Is Bangkok the biggest city in Thailand? Oh, yes, it is. It is the biggest city in Thailand. Ah, oh, okay. Okay. Like you can say, who is the most beautiful actress mm. in, in Thailand okay. now this is also the question who is the most beautiful actress in Thailand mm -hmm. okay do you do you have Thai movies yes I have a lot of Thai movies and we have a lot of actress mm -hmm. in Thailand okay. So you have to use this, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm, yes. You make sentences on that and the second part of adjective I'll tell you next time. But before that I want to tell you today the English culture part mm -hmm. three. three. Yes. English culture part 3 I am going to tell you as you have already known England is a very well developed country and the people they are very intelligent they are not highly educated so their way of celebrating festival or uh, developing their child is totally different and now I am going to tell you something about uh, their business and their shops and market also. Mm -hmm. Actually, you know, uh, in England, if anybody who wants to be an electrician, plumber, carpenter, mm -hmm. bricklayer, or means any means anybody who wants to be a plumber, electrician barber or bricklayer even tailor then they have to take a certification course from an institute mm -hmm. okay when they qualify they are given certificate by the institute mm -hmm. then they are eligible to open a shop okay but they cannot open their shop anywhere where they like no there is a rule that how they can open their shop in the market mm. okay so suppose they want to open a shop in a particular area mm -hmm. 
then they go to the local government office and they inform them that they want to open that shop in that particular area then the officers from that office come to have a survey of that area suppose a man wants to be a barber and he wants to open a shop hair cutting barber and mm -hmm. they come to that area and they inquire if that particular shop is needed in that area according to the population or not if suppose in that area two barbers are already there mm. then third barber is not given the permission to open a shop okay. okay then he is asked to search for another place after opening their shops they have to pay 30% of the income to the government as income tax this is the rule this is the third part of english culture oh okay okay a lot of a lot of uh, 30% i think it's a lot yeah. yes <laughs> oh so surprised how much do you pay how yeah. much income tax do you pay For now, right? Seven. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Same in India. Ah, Seven. actually, it depends on your income. Oh, oh yes, yes. Same in Thailand. Depend on the uh, the place that we uh, got the uh, <laughs> like uh, I think mm, if in the service, uh -huh, only three. Okay. It depends actually, you know. Mm. And uh, I'll tell you my story, the how oh. how I went to England, mm. how I was interviewed oh. on okay. phone. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, one year, right? You, you go to that one. You went to that one year, right? No, I went there in two thousand two. Oh yes, yes. I think it's how long that you spend. I two months. Oh, two months. Oh, yeah. okay. Which month? Which month? In the winter or in summer? Or it might be summer, I think, because it was June, I think. Oh, June. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So how I was interviewed, what I was asked to write in English, and everything I'll tell you. Okay. And, and okay. So I wrote actually that English culture one, two, three. They were so happy, so happy to know that. That means mm -hmm. I knew all these things about England. Yeah. Oh, I think it's very good time. Yeah. For you. Yeah. Okay. Two thousand. Okay. 2002. Uh, I am only uh, 12. <laughs> you were a child. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. write questions also. An English okay. culture part three okay. and sentences also. Okay. Okay. I have to first. Okay. Active. Right. competitive uh-huh and uh competitive yes mm -hmm. competitive and uh okay one minute one minute competitive and for story uh -huh. and uh, questions okay competitive superlative Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. 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 I'll see you on Tuesday. Oh, uh, Tuesday. Okay. Have a good weekend. You too. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye.